Boston Red Sox ever send you a happy birthday text and email? No. Wishing you a very happy birthday from the New York Yankees. We hope to celebrate with you soon at the ballpark. And then look what they did over here. They sent me an email that said, happy birthday, use this code, and get a discount on some tickets. That's the difference between the Yankees and the Red Sox. They care about their fans. Or I just don't have email notifications from the Red Sox, you fucking nerd. Josh! Hey, welcome back to our stupid reactions of Corbin. Go Yankees. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thanks to Patreon, follow the account, subscribe to the like button. And uh, today we have another video from uh, Watch Mojo. Yay! They just love Indian content, don't they? They sure do. And this is uh, 10 richest Bollywood actors of all time. Wow! I can already tell you the richest. Shah Rukh Khan. He's one of the richest actors in the world. I think he's like 700 something million dollars. <laughs> like... I'm gonna. I wouldn't bet against that. Something being number stupid. One. Yeah. I who would, else? Who would rival him? I mean, money I think, bag. Money bags. Canadian Aksha. <laughs> Aksha. Well, we know he's made a lot of money, so it won't surprise me if he's no, in that group because he's always seeking the cash. I think it's Shah Rukh Khan. I, I think Salman Khan's got a, quite a bit of lettuce, man. Yeah. Salman Khan's probably in this top ten. Yeah, I'd imagine. <laughs> and uh, so I'm saying, I bet it's gonna be SRK. Just because of the lifetime earnings, Big B's probably in there. Lifetime yeah. earnings. Yeah, SRK, Big Akshay, B, Salman, Salman. Akshay, Amir. I don't know that um, Amir's going to be in there. You don't think so? I don't know. I mean, he he's has clearly really, really Dongle successful. Made so much money. Won't surprise me if he's in there. Now, but more, that, if this is, how is about this Bollywood? the ladies? Is this Bollywood? Yes. Okay. How about the ladies? Mm. The first one, obviously, comes to mind is going to be Taboo. She's not... You don't think she's going to be in the top ten? No, I do. I'm predicting. I'm predicting. Not taboo. Even, not even close. Will pierce the top because ten because she's not been in the biggest hits. She's the one of the greatest, probably actress. I think her lifetime of work. No, absolutely not. She's puts not, her in that. She's position. not going to sniff the top ten. You don't think so? No. All right. We'll I think see. somebody like uh, Shwarya could. That's possible. Do you think it's? I mean, well, this was done. This is brand Priyanka. new. Priyanka. Priyanka's. On this here. is brand new, right? Yeah. Okay, so yeah, Priyanka's Priyanka. going to be in the top. Priyanka's ten. going to be in the top ten. We got Priyanka, SRK, Salman Khan, Akshay. probably Akshay and Big B, Priyanka, that we're in agreement on. I think leaves... Amir will be on there. You think Amir, he'll, you think he'll be there? So yeah, this is just Bollywood. Yeah, this is just Bollywood. Maybe Topeka, but she might be too new. I I know we're going to see some names that are going to make us slap our head and go, why Ali is didn't we new? think about it? Ali is way too new, and I think Topeka's way too new. Although Topeka's made some bank. I, 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 think I would Topeka be might shocked. Be on, actually, because she has makeup stuff, too. Oh, she does. So like, Yeah, it, she's got a lot of endorsements. you got to have endorsements. So it's not just a film. Yeah, Priyan I will be shocked if Priyanka Chopra is not on there. Here we go. How many beds does Jersey have? Zenobia. Please answer. I, I would say at least 350. Welcome to Ms. Mojo. And today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 richest Bollywood actors. That's the richest right that's there. Your, that's your number one. For this list, we're looking at the most Salmon. wealthy actors and actresses with a strong brand image among Bollywood audiences. Although there are some well-known filmmakers yeah. who also act occasionally, we've kept this list strictly to Ashwarya. Did Let's see what happens. Favorites feature in this list? Did they Were just say it's specifically just networks? actors? Let us know in the comments. Like male? You, no, male and female. Number 10. Ali ah, Abad. she is in this because of endorsements. Topeka is going to be in there then. Performers. 10 years ago when I started working, all I thought about was how I would one day take over the world. <laughs> you will. How everyone everywhere would know who I am. Her net worth is valued at around $60 million. This includes nice. her box office hits, brand endorsements, and her production house, Eternal Sunshine yeah. Productions, that's, which recently released Darling. That's the most yeah. of it. Production company and brand deals and... Secret. Uh, but I get up time. Hold on. Although she mentioned in an interview oh, that she wasn't Rambier. keen on investments, Anya has invested in quite a few ventures. Does that include family money? Run, styling platform, run a beer. And fashion e -commerce now, company, all of his and ads, oh, I think Run Beer's in there. Recycles floral waste. She if Ali is in there, sustainable kids Run brand, Beer is in which there. Which also produces maternity wear. The maternity wear, which, which I was seeing, was just all 
it had a certain style. If anybody has a makeup brand, they're going like to be in the top 10. Screaming maternity. <laughs> I was like, okay, I want to bring my own style into it, which is what I did. Without a doubt, Ali Abad and Money are darlings to one another. <laughs> Number nine. Priyanka there she Chopra. is. That's low. Priyanka I thought she'd be higher. Low. I thought she'd be in the top five. I guess they're not including Nick Jonas as well either. Happily ever after. You know, I just felt like, wow, my life has suddenly changed. I'd say over a hundred like million. That, and now it's all on me. Her estimated fortune reportedly stands at seventy million dollars oh, wow. as of two thousand twenty-two, which includes what she gets paid for movies, guest appearances, That's gotta and be higher than that. One could argue that her life is even more than a fairy tale, with a mansion in the U.S., luxury homes in Mumbai, expensive cars a private jet, and being wed to Nick Jonas, of course. Our life is different, yeah. okay? It, there's a big difference between a husband and a boyfriend. A husband, even a fiance. I didn't understand the gravity of that when I got married. <laughs> <laughs> but it's a good thing to be married to a good husband. Yeah. Chopra has also shown a strong inclination to be a businesswoman. Heck yeah. Into real estate with multiple properties across Mumbai. Seems also that net worth seems house, low. A restaurant. I mean, with Nick, it's here. well over a hundred million. First step was partnering up with Indian American entrepreneur Manish Goyal to open a New York City restaurant called Sona. Didn't you want to so go there? I did want to go there. <laughs> I grew then up you saw the price, the and, and then I saw the prices. Very important. <laughs> Besides that, her investment in one of the leading dating apps is pretty well known too. Number eight, Aishwarya Rai Bachchan. Knew it. Aishwarya Rai Bachchan has a remarkable presence and an illustrious I love career that the spanning first not three are women. Hollywood, but also Hollywood. Sorry, I'm a bit late. My flight was delayed. Here. Oh, she was in that. Film. Did you see that? Movie? Oh yeah, yeah yeah yeah. I never saw that I movie. Am yeah. Detective. Her stature around the world has certainly added to her net worth, which is said to be around $100 million. Yeah, Here are just that makes some sense. of her assets. A lavish villa in Dubai. And does that include- luxurious properties in Mumbai. No, and that's just her. Really the Bakshan's assets? That's just her. Some swanky cars. She has also invested in startups across environmental intelligence and healthcare. Time Magazine named her one of the world's most influential people. This Bollywood beauty is a shrewd businesswoman. Although she isn't seen too often in Hindi movies, her Remuneration is said to be high, with a purported Recently. salary somewhere oh. <laughs> around $1.5 million per film. Yeah. Which is really, really low we also then, yeah. compared to Hollywood. Innumerable endorsement deals with She'd Indian make 10 times that brands. in an American film. Number seven, Saif Ali Khan. Hey! hey! Among the top Sartaj! Ali Khan's I mean, he does come from royalty. Saif Ali Khan's net worth definitely lands him somewhere on the list of richest actors. How's the business done? Well, I mean, in, in a couple of words, really well. Um, and yeah, it's been great. While he has been in Bollywood for as long as some of the others on this list, his career took Dust. a turn for the better with the OTT series Sacred Games in 2018. <laughs> That also led to a boom in his brand endorsements. So what's his net worth? Apparently close to $150 million. Wow, I did not expect that. Homes in Me America, too. I mean, I guess it makes sense. Bungalows and a lush apartment in Mumbai. If you didn't know, Khan is also part of the Patodi royal family, whose ancestral palace is estimated to be worth nearly $100 million. I think a lot of people tend to forget is, well, you're Nawab and all those things in terms of lineage. You're actually an extremely self-made person. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, <laughs> we can carry on. Number six, Amir Khan. Yeah. No list it. of Bollywood's richest actors is complete without talking about the top three cons. We start with Bollywood's Mr. Perfection. That means the other two Amir are included. Oh, I, I had no doubt Salman Khan is in there. So he's five, right? A massive sea face Yeah, is this five or six? I think five. Is a for an A-lister. And Amir checks the box with his 5,000 square foot home. Madam, <laughs> they he owns a farmhouse as well as a few other apartments in some of Mumbai's posher locations. Amir has also invested in a furniture rental startup. Did we mention his fleet of luxury cars? Well, that's pretty much a given with his superstar status, isn't it? Two to three hundred million? <laughs> Number five, Akshay Kumar. 
Akshay Kumar is easily one of Bollywood's most bankable stars and highest paid celebrities. He Very made sure of that. It reflects in his acting fees, which are said to be over $12 million per film. His net worth is estimated to be around $300 million. A master of martial arts. He is a busy man with- Good on you, Canadian yeah. Kumar. I'm, I'm companies. betting Can you believe it? I get Shah Rukh is to know that approaching billionaire status. Arts. No, I, from last I saw, it was seven to 800 yeah, million. Yeah, yeah, yeah. also started doing it. He owns a Kabaddi team in the World Kabaddi League and has stakes in another Kolkata based team in the Kabaddi okay. League. Hold Am on, I saying it wrong? <laughs> we probably are saying it wrong. And property investments. But they say it that way. We've heard them when they're playing. Kabaddi, Kabaddi, They say Kabaddi, 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 Kabaddi. Number four. Ritik Roshan. Oh, oh what, what the crap? Can't believe I forgot Ritik. Ritik Roshan is the Greek god of beauty. Who else did I forget? That's four salmon. I'm surprised he's ahead of Akshay. We're missing one. Is Topeka in the top four? more precise. His fitness brand, it's either, HRX alone, who would you think it is? Around $25 million. Topeka or Runveer? I think it's Runveer. You never really get to the end. It is a strange truth. Of course, we couldn't omit his luxurious apartments, impressive collection of I can't believe I forgot Rithik. Me too. A lavish farmhouse to boot. A water to boot. home and a slew of brand endorsements are also things Russian can boast about if he so chooses. Number three, Salman Khan. Salman Khan has been gifting us with Bollywood blockbuster hits for over three decades now. So his movie fee of over $12 million is just the tip of the iceberg when it comes to his net worth. He owns an- Four probably gone up now after Patan. In one of Mumbai's prime locations. Four to 500 million, I bet, for Salman Khan. He also owns a farmhouse spread across 150 acres, properties in India and Dubai, and a private yacht. Did we mention he's the owner of the Being Human lifestyle brand? And then there's his production house, brand endorsements, and vehicles. Wait, there's a wee bit more. Big Boss, the popular reality show that he hosts, has also added immensely to his brand value. You started. Stan. Any guesses on his net worth? Close to $400 million. Makes sense. Number two, Amitabh Bachchan. Ah. Here's a man who managed to work his way to the top. I guess that makes a lot of sense, right? He started out with very little and ended up with a seven-figure salary. The veteran actor has a net worth of close to $410 million. Not he a surprise. He has his wealth with films, brand endorsements, real estate investments, and tweets that are numbered. And a fleet of fancy <laughs> cars. At the age of 80, this is an actor who can brag about owning a private jet. Well, if divine intervention brings abundance, then indulge, we say. Simply put, the Big B lives the big, lavish life. How is the bond business, Mr. Cowley? Yeah. Uh, fine, thank you. I understand you're looking for a business connection. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel. You mean, and before you talk about Shah Rukh Khan, who's going to blow everybody you away with almost a double their yeah. worth? He's... Videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, yeah, be sure to he... go into your settings. I think he's 700 to 800 million. Last I checked. Number one, yeah. Shah Rukh Khan. Yeah. Bollywood Badshah, King Khan, King of Romance. He's known by many names in the world of film. Probably more now after Pata. <laughs> Khan owns the production house Red Chili's Entertainment with his wife Gauri Khan. Then there's the Red Chili's VFX studio. Cricket lovers are familiar with him as co-owner yep. of the Indian Premier League Kolkata. cricket team Kolkata Knight Riders. In 2022, he also added a women's cricket team to his roster with Trinbago Knight Riders in the Caribbean Premier League. He also hosts numerous TV shows and invests in a sizable list of brand endorsements that include a healthcare firm, a gaming app, soft drinks, automobiles, beauty care products, and more. Well, these surely explain how his net worth is nearly, wait for it, $800 million. <laughs> yep, there's a reason he's yep. top dog. Do you agree with our picks? I Check do. Check out this other recent clip from Ms. I am is this surprised. one that you have to agree with? Though? I know, really. I, mean, <laughs> I am surprised. I thought, and I guess he just doesn't have international branding the way a lot of those folks do, like a Rithik. And Rithik's obviously been around longer, but I, yeah. I, I've seen so many different ads that Ranveer has done and stuff that he's done with clothing and music and things of that nature. Well, but, the issue is if if those are all just Indian, yeah. they still don't pay. 
So if right, you have right, exactly. That's what I mean. I meant by, we've heard them say it. Like, there's a difference what you're paid in India, mm. which is probably a lot for a lot of obviously twelve million. But if somebody of somebody like Akshay's status, which is basically kind of like Tom Cruise's status here, Tom Cruise gets a lot more than twelve million dollars for a movie. Oh yeah, it's upwards of twenty something million. But also, especially he, after Maverick. Yeah, but also he's. He owns the production house as well, so he, right. he actually gets a lot. He more He owns than that his own studio, <laughs> so he, he gets a lot more than that per. Yeah, <laughs> he doesn't need to worry about his fee as an actor because yeah. he's going to be making percentage because he's. But producing. if you make makeup brands or whatever, and you sell it by the dollar as opposed to by the rupee, mm. you're going to be making a lot more money. Yeah, of, and that's that's just something I just can't comprehend. Grant, uh, granted, Topeka and Renvier are not <laughs> hurting for money. No, 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 no. <laughs> not at all. Not at all. But I just, I, I just. For me, and it, this is not a judgment at all. It's just different strokes for different folks. I cannot comprehend mm. having y your what? What's the phrase to say about your thing in so many fires? Uh, the your your penis. No, oh, your poker. Yeah, your pen. Oh, okay. Having this. Yes. Uh, I I can't comprehend. Having as an actor your mind on so many different business dealings, like a production company and a sports team, and a, a, a gaming app, well, that would just—he doesn't. Uh, no, he, I. He doesn't. He. I nobody does. Like he he owns the Night Rider. He doesn't run the Night Riders. He like he's literally just the bankroll. I, I understand. So like, if you at a certain level, you pay but, certain people to run the stuff, so you don't. But really it's have to still think about it. it's still when you're doing your taxes, you're thinking about it. Oh, he doesn't do his taxes. Yeah, of course not. <laughs> but I promise you, the person doing his taxes, when, when he goes to bed at night, he's thinking about these things. I doubt it. They're actually. on his mind. He has to go and do things to support the Night Riders and promote them in some way. He has to do things occasionally to promote Red Chilies. He has to do some things to promote his game. At the very least, his time is going to be involved in some way, shape, or form in these things. Yes, there are some things I'm sure he's just written a check to and it's gone and he makes the money off of yeah, most as an investment. But there's a lot of things where the investment gets its return because it's got his name and face on it. And I just can't fathom. And there's a lot of actors. Here. Well, I mean, Cruz is a great example. You don't see Tom Cruise doing a lot of endorsements for anything. Granted, he doesn't need to. He owns the production house. Yeah. No, neither does I mean, neither does Shah Rukh Khan. Shah Rukh Khan doesn't need to endorse or do anything. Mm -hmm. He could make he could be well off beyond the stratosphere of anybody just by the reason of his acting alone. Mm -hmm. So I just I I just to have that many fires going on at one time, that's mind boggling to me. Just like with with Priyanka, I cannot. That's why you have fathom multiple it. assistants. So they tell you where to go. That <laughs> I didn't. I just wouldn't want that for me personally. I would want. Let me act, and and I'm I'm a, I'm a happy camper. His, I'd want his bank account. That's for sure. <laughs> yeah, I, I, the bank account would be great. I just wouldn't want it with that many different responsibilities that are wanting and vying for my attention. Hmm. Uh, anyways. Uh, It'd be interesting. Obviously, I know. I'm hoping they they branch out a little more outside of Bollywood. Um, yeah, um, because obviously, I'd be interested overall in India. Who is the richest? Absolutely. Does the junior NTRs of the world come into hand? Does right. The, um, Rajnikanth. Rajnikanth. Yeah. Oh, I mean, I, I assume he'd be top three. I would imagine Rajnikanth has got to be way up there. Yeah, and then. VJ's. And at this point, Rajamouli. I mean, yeah. Rajamouli's. I mean, get take it away from actors. Yeah, take it into the realm of other creatives in yeah. the industry. I'd assume. You know who I'm surprised? I th I'm sure if you took it outside the realm of actors, I, Karan Johar is making some bank. <laughs> yeah, he might be. <laughs> he's making. He's some probably bank. If, at minimum close to Shah Rukh Khan. Yeah, I would be shocked if. Karan Johar's not in the 250 million or above range. Quarter billion. That would surprise me. It says 215 million. Yeah, but it says my net worth is 18 million. So, so like you're you, close. So maybe you should go into I business. Maybe you should yeah. go into business together. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Google searches are are <laughs> mine's accurate. Uh, anyways, uh, let us know what you thought about the video and other videos we can react to. And uh, if any of you top actors would like to send us money, please do.
Juice!